Warning. The following game is rated mature and contains content not suitable for younger viewers. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everyone and welcome back to Batman Arkham VR. On the last episode, we uh, finished the game, well at least we finished the story, by heading over to the sewers to go find out where Robin went. Uh, when we arrived there, we saw Killer Croc briefly, and we heard Joker over the intercom, which is weird because he should be dead. Uh, we found Robin in a cage, so we went down there to go help him, only to get caught in a cage ourselves. We had to use uh, the two abilities we had, such as, you know, grabbing stuff and grabbing stuff with our hands, uh, to free Robin from his cage before Killer Croc destroyed him and ate him. Uh, then he tried to free us from our cage, only for Killer Croc to get the jump on him and potentially eat him. But we didn't see that happen because we all of a sudden got warped to Arkham Asylum, which is odd. We walked down the hallway, found out that Joe Chill just happened to be here. So we headed over to where the uh, jail cells were at in intensive treatment and found the Joker. But he's dead. And then we were in the cage. Which doesn't make sense, until we realize that everything that's been happening has been a dream. It was all a dream. Uh, this is Batman's first realization that the Joker blood inside of him is very, very dangerous. So he dreamed up the whole thing about him going after Nightwing and breaking his neck, going after the Penguin Thugs and exploding them so no one could tell, and then capturing Robin inside that thing and having Killer Croc eat him, all while we thought it was the Joker. So, story's over. It continues on in Arkham Knight, which we've already played. But, we have some Riddler stuff now. <laughs> so we're going to do some Riddler stuff. I hope the audio is a little better. Uh, I know that it was peaking a lot because, I mean, I can only do so much with the Valve Index microphones. I did end up finding, like, a tiny pop filter that I taped to the bottom of the of the index. So we'll see how that goes. Am I recording audio? I am recording audio. And the game audio is recording, too. Uh, I should say as well, I recorded the first four episodes, only to find out I didn't record any game audio, so I had to re-record the first three episodes. <laughs> so, let's go. We have the manor, we have, and we have suit up. We're going to be getting these two levels done, and I don't think we're going to be getting any destructibles done. There's 18 destructibles, we're going to have to blow them all up. Uh, yeah, we're going to do manor, suit up, and then we're going to do dead end, tipping point, and maybe another one we'll see where we go i think i think this will take us we're on episode four right now i think this will take us four five six maybe seven and then finish off eight so we'll see you know any stragglers that we might have forgotten so press the wrong button I'm standing like right at the edge of my I put down I put down some wooden planks on my floor for my for my uh chair to have traction. Then I put a computer mat over it, a computer chair mat <laughs> underneath it, over top of it. But I'm like right at the edge Good of night, it. Sir. Hi, Alfred! When did you return? Right now. Some awareness of your movements would be appreciated. You do know that one's own bed would make for more comfortable sleeping arrangements than a piano. Grand or otherwise. I could sleep like this. Ordinarily, I would beg you to take a night's rest, but... Well, we have a situation. I'll explain downstairs. Ah, you were looking for this, I imagine. Thank you. Very good, sir. I'll see you downstairs. Bye, Dream Alfred. Remember, this is all a dream. That's going to stay there. Okay. Bye, Alfred. At least I get to see where you go this time. I'm, not, I'm, I'm going to keep my eye on you. Where the heck do you go? I assume, yeah, there's that hallway right there. And he's going down that hallway right there. Okay. Bye. How does he beat us down? I don't understand. It's a shame we, didn't get, we don't get to explore any of that. Because everything we do around here is going to be over here. Hey, at least we can finally see what these things are. Also, look at that. Enigma Cube. <laughs> Did you think you found me? I'm buried beneath so many layers of encryption that the result resembles a magnificent tyranny sue of protection. 
Even if you do puncture my defenses by matching two pictures on this board, I'll just send you away with some junk data I found lying around the place. Okay, so the Rid how Riddler thing works is here is that there's... Oh god, math is failing me. 30 things here. And uh, when we find a Riddler thing, like in a cube or a riddle or a question mark thing that we can find, uh, we get to reveal one of these things. And we have like three seconds to see what they all are beforehand. So... There, we got Alfred's face. But currently nothing happens because there's two Alfred faces. I pulled the cord on my controller. So, that was one of the Riddler things. We already found one of them. Let's go over there. Okay. Well, if you remembered, we got this from Selena Kyle, this postcard from Cape Town. Oop, over here, we have a postcard from oop, Beijing, also from Selena Kyle. I like how it says Bruce Wayne, Wayne Manor, 107... Harlow Drive? Gotham. No state. I still I can't read what that says. <laughs> also Buenos Aires. Domino's Pizza. Uh, sir, if you'd please venture downstairs. There's a matter I must bring to your attention. And now might be a good time to check the piano's in tune. It is in tune. I don't need to do that. I mean, technically I could. Last time I did it. As all I had to do was... I'm a genius. But now that thing appears, and that's the thing that sends me downstairs. Instead of just tapping a couple buttons and automatically going down. Over here. Got another postcard. Oh, the fire's out. This one is also from Selena Kyle. Nice, but if you notice, Buenos Aires lost diamonds, Queens diamonds missing, that just happens to be in London. This, I mean, this is obviously in Buenos Aires. Cape Town jewel heist, excuse me, and Bajang diamond stolen, so. She's sending me postcards where she stole stuff. <laughs> and she's taunting me. Well, I mean, I don't think at this point she knows that I'm batman yet she does an arkham knight she might just be sending these to taunt bruce wayne and not realizing that oh this is technically clues for something that she's doing <laughs> also there's this uh, when i programmed that one to hide on the other side of the world i had something less possible in mind <laughs> the the joy of only having 30 riddles is that they're going to be a lot more unique Although there are some things that repeat. Alfred's thing is right there, so I want to get that one. I timed that wrong. Hey, it's our dad. All right, well, that's that clue. Uh, there's only one left in, in uh, the manor. I think that's supposed to be Judge Wayne. I don't remember what his name is. Is it Solomon? I have no clue who that is. We. Oui. Okay, so we have this cool table, which is basically just a recreation of the map of Arkham Knight. Uh, here's uh, Bleak Island right here. This is the first starting island. Uh, this is where the lighthouse is. Unfortunately, the lighthouse seems to be missing. And then this is the bridge that leads out. Over here is Miyagani Island. This is where all of downtown is. Here's where Wayne Manor, or that giant Wayne Tower building is, where Lucius Fox was at. Uh, oh, look at this. Pick one of these up. Six dots. Hmm. This is where, like where the docks were at. Also, that is where the Riddler stuff was at. So let me go put this right here. Fits. Here, see, here's that other Wayne Tower building. This one goes over here. There we go. Let's grab this. This one has four red dots on it. But it should go right there. We got a LexCorp thing. Nine green dots. And this one is actually right next door to Wayne Tower. Wrong number. A Master Bruce? Is everything all right? Is there a problem with the piano? Nope. No 
wonder if we heard that. <laughs> Whoop! Here's the lighthouse. All right, that needs to be all the buildings in. Ah, look at this. LexCorp Wayne Enterprises. I'm holding this very far away for you, probably, but I can read this. Uh, all the blue is Wayne. All the red is Lex. So it looks like he's trying to take over Wayne, or he's trying to take over Gotham. Development and analysis, anal analytics group, Transnational Incorporated, or Enterprises, Gotham Technical Research, AJL Limited, uh, Metropolis Analytics. So we're just barely holding a lead over Lex Luthor. Hmm. I mean, that's why there's the LexCorp building that was in Night. All right, but now to the riddle. There we go. This needs to equal 13. What that means is we need 13 of these green dots. So I'm just going to toss them off the table so that they'll respawn. Go away. Go away. <laughs> Bye. So what I need to do is I need to put 13 green dots down while, you know, so it equals that. This one has six. This one has five. This one has negative one. The red ones are negative. Lex has nine. And this one is negative four. So negative four, six, five, negative one, and nine. My math is failing me right now. If I had a pen and paper, I'd easily solve it. <laughs> uh, 13. I need to get to 14 or eight or 17 and then subtract it. Nine plus five is 14. So let's put the five one in. Put the nine one in. And then we'll subtract the one. So five plus nine minus one should equal 13. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Give me that. Very good. You put all the blocks in the right place. Like a child. Child. I'm a child! Alright. Let's get one of these. Yeah! It was you, wasn't it? Behind every humiliation. The author of every defeat. I suppose you thought your precious fourth wall would protect you. You, you, you. Well, there's only one wall here, and I'm safely ensconced behind it. So what this does is it'll it unlocks an Alfred model from the model viewer back down in the bat computer. Same thing can go for our father once we eventually lock him. That's why we had all those locked. Oh, it's really hard to do quotations in VR. But that should be all of them here. There's nothing to destroy because I can't currently destroy stuff. I mean, I can by just go over there. <laughs> but it's more like, you know, explode something or break something and I don't have my powers yet and by powers I mean gadgets but we can at least do one more thing uh one there's this I know what this song is except I already forgot so I'm lying Damn. <laughs> darn it you know there's there's an easy way to find out Rock-a-bye, baby! That's what the song is. Hey! Oh, it's a picture of us and our mom. Also, there's this. Hey, Bruce, remember to take a day off. Now and again. JT. This is Bruce and Jason Todd. What a happy memory. Taking you with me. 
Duh, duh, duh. <laughs> you go right there. Yeah, so that's what this song is. Lilla, Bo Lilla Bolero. Oh, it went back. You have new messages received yesterday at 8.37 p.m. Bruce, it's Vicky. I missed you at the gala last night. <laughs> Look, I know we're technically not a thing, but standing me up last minute is not cool. For a philanthropist, you're kind of a jerk sometimes. Next new message received yesterday at 9.23 p.m. Uh, Mr. Wayne, it's Alex Drescher calling from the mayor's office. I, I just wanted to thank you for your substantial donation to the Arkham City Redevelopment Fund. <laughs> Gotham is lucky to have you, sir. Next new message. Master Bruce, it's Alfred again. I'm so old now, sir. When will you let me die? <laughs> I think you can hear the first two the first time through, but you can't hear the Joker one until after the reveal. But we're done here. We've done everything in this room, so let's go down. Welcome. Suit up sequence initiated. Biometric signature required. Okay, so this is a very small area. We're only in this position for like the entire level. So there's gonna be some things. Fat suit version 7.13. Ready for deployment. It's gonna be very easy to find the three the the three uh riddle stuff here. I mean we already see one, it's right down there. There's also a green glow right there, so there must be something right there as well. Let me just grab this. Please engage gauntlet apertures. Bye, bat suit. I mean, I'm already wearing it. So, there's some ways to, to determine that it's a dream very early on. One of them is right here. Like, listen very closely. That sounded like an alarm clock, didn't it? Please begin, Cowl calibration routine. Calibrating. <laughs> a calibrating. This is the same mirror that tells us we're sick. complete. Oh, yeah, it retrieves objects, all right. Careful! You can't afford to burn through brain cells so quickly. At this rate, the only tasks left to you will be using cutlery and reading young adult to stop. Ah! Try all you like, you'll never reach me. Me, because I know your weakness. You are easily distracted by trivial rewards. Yes, I am. Hey, we got our dad. Calibrating targeting. Please fire grapple gun at target. Also, I kind of like some young dystopian novels. <laughs> grapple gun targeting calibrated. Get in my pocket. Forensic scanner. Ready for deployment. Software update allows for crime scene visualization and multi-layer analysis. Calibrating diagnostics. Please scan target. All right, so this thing is going to help us find Riddler stuff very easily now. Because this, I mean, we don't have detective vision, and usually whenever we see question marks or, like, riddles laid out anywhere, uh, it's usually in detective mode. So all we have to do is start scanning this now. And uh, this metal beast has lost its way. Perhaps it was a ricochet. Metal beast. All right, so there's a riddle. There's a riddle right there. So there should be something in here that wasn't in here the first time. That is a very big. I mean, what's a metal beast that could be in here? Uh, 
That thing. The Batarang. Metal Bat. You know, if those things actually came back when you threw them, you wouldn't need an infinite, infinite supply. supply. But I'm rich. I can get an infinite supply. I have to buy in bulk. Alright, looks like we're starting to work on Penguin. So, if I remember correctly, it was two cubes and a riddle. So, we did the riddle and we've done one of the cubes. So, I don't need this anymore. Diagnostics calibrated. Batarangs ready for deployment. Aerodynamically designed for rapid flight and high impact. Calibrating targeting. Hey! Please use a batarang hey. to hit the target. Batarangs equipped to utility belt. Hit three targets to continue calibration. Batarang targeting calibrated. Yeah. <laughs> calibration complete. All right, I need to hurry up with this because we're only getting one chance. Also, listen right now. That music is the Lola Bolero, except in Batman form. Do, 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 do. Pull that. Kind of like how in Arkham Origins there were Christmas songs mixed in with all the Batman music. All right. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. There it is. Aha! Ah, I know. There weren't many places to hide that one, one, one. Oh, well, darn it. I was one away, okay. Doesn't really matter if we get them in order, like get the first one and then get the second one immediately after, cause we're gonna be getting them all, so who cares? Yeah! Well, we're going down to the bat cave, but we're gonna probably, how long has it been? It's about 20 something minutes. <laughs> probably gonna end it here. Hi, bats. Especially because there's so many, like, Riddler stuff that's gonna be here. There's the majority of the Riddler stuff is here. Well, most of them, like, nine of them. Let me land. I mean, look at that. That's kind of obvious. All right. Ah, sir, you're here. Where'd you, how do you- oh, Please let me know when I can brief you on the situation. How do you get down? All right, well, we're gonna end it here. So we'll be continuing on from <laughs> the Nightwing scene and we'll do the Penguin scene. And yeah. That sounds right. Like two per? We'll see how long it takes. Maybe we maybe we move on into another one just in case. So, on the next episode of Batman Arkham Ar I almost a night Arkham VR. <laughs> I forgot what I was wearing. Uh, it's a shame that the zoom in is kind of broken because, like, I can see kind of fine, but the like it's a circle and then it has like half of the other circle for the other eye. Uh, we could just continue next time as we deal with more Riddler challenges like this thing right here so until next time hopefully you enjoy